Dog, pig, dog, pig, dog, pig, loaf of bread. Well, that just deals my pickles. If it walks like a furnace and quacks like a furnace, <laughs> it's a furnace. Hello? <laughs> I just got myself a blazer laser. Yeehaw! Bow wow wow. Bark bark bark. Bowie wowie bark bark. <laughs> Get over here. Boom, one shot. Yeah, that was awesome. Thank you, 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 thank you. Pig, dog, pig, dog, pig, loaf of bread. <laughs> How does it feel to be owned by potassium? <laughs> it feels pretty miserable. You shall not pass. I think to myself, egg. If it walks like a furnace and quacks like a furnace, <laughs> it's a furnace. I hate you, dragon. I like saying Hail Mary because my name's Mary.
Hiya, cupcakes. So I didn't see the Zelda and the countdown and everything because I actually just got a phone call from the cremation place saying that everything's done. So I took that quick phone call and I was like, I've totally got time. And then Andrew and I had to talk about it for a second. So I'm so sorry. Okay, so 17 seconds is the time. Excellent. That is excellent to know. I was actually just thinking about it the other day and I thought, you know, I can give I can give Shinespark like a like a I think I have it here. It says it is it says it's 18 seconds long. It's an 18 second long clip, but apparently 17 seconds. 27 on mobile. Excellent. Excellent. Nicely done. Nicely done. Look at all these amazing people. Look Hello. At Look at you guys. We've got Grandpa, we've got Land Rider, Rumi, Trekkie, KM, Hayes, Chiron. Oh my gosh, look at all these amazing people. Shine Spark. You see all Shine Sparks. Regular, regular <laughs> commands. We've got Jordachi. How's it going, Jordachi? I don't want to miss anybody. We've got Chain and koala hello how's how how's it how is it um I, I came prepared today i brought a straw also i'm using head uh earphones today um because uh i sometimes get headaches with my headphones that go over my head hey it's collector hmm happy wednesday yeah i uh we've been kind of um, in contact with my Aunt Judy and my cousins and whatnot. And uh, we are kind of planning the memorial. Um, I think all us kids are dog, gonna be speaking. Dog, pig, dog, pig, dog, and, pig, loaf uh, of bread. We've got some songs we wanna play, uh, but all that is kind of um, coming together. And then we still have to get our flights. Um, and then I just got a call, seriously, right before I like came into this, I just got a call saying everything's done on the um, cremation side. So I just made an appointment next Wednesday to go in and pick all that stuff up. And, um, I finally got the death certificates yes, or the death certificate yesterday. So hopefully everything kind of like, hopefully we can get my mom's bank accounts closed and all, all that stuff. So it's all kind of sort of happening. I hope it all happens quickly from here on out because it's just like, this all this waiting has just been really really frustrating and <laughs> everything sounds so much louder in my ears and i sound so much quieter because like i feel like i feel like i'm whispering <laughs> i don't think i am am i whispering Anner? if you just said something i couldn't hear what you said <laughs> I'm using earphones today because I don't want my head to be squeezed. Yeah, it is nice to have progress because for the longest time, you know, now for like a month, I've literally just been sitting around and just waiting. I had to make a whole bunch of phone calls and do a whole bunch of work when everything first happened. And then we've just sat around. And then when I found out the funeral home had hit a snag, but nobody had called me, I'm glad I called them to like check up on things because who knows how long it would have taken. Mm. I think I like drinking Dr. Pepper through a straw better. Is that strange? Um, Land Rider got a uh, free hot dog for lunch. I would absolutely take a free hot dog all the time, every day. I think hot dogs are great. I still feel like every morning, normally I take a walk every morning with Auden and I push her in a jogging stroller. Um, but I have not done that since like before I got COVID. And every morning I wake up and I'm like, maybe today's the day. And then I just don't, I just feel like I'm, I just feel like I'm gonna push it. So I'm taking things kind of one day at a time, but we do have the birthday party this weekend. So that's kind of a big deal. When Charlotte gets home today, I'm gonna use um, fabric chark or chark fabric chalk and I'm gonna mark around her sleeve. And then I think tomorrow we're going to, I'm gonna do the sleeve. And then you guys can kind of let me know. I, Friday, I can set up my phone out in my family room and I can decorate my family room on stream or I cannot, and I can do that in the morning and we can play games. I don't know. If that's something that interests you guys, let me know. <laughs> fabric chalk. It's Susie in space. Jay, how are you? Good to see you. 
Um, <laughs> while secretly ignoring the fact that I have to write a French entry that's 150 words, all in the past tense by three. Should probably get on that. Should probably, probably get on that. Okay, so um, I have two new commands. What should they be called? I have, let's go into studio mode here so I can um, activate them and you guys can see them. I don't know how loud they are. Um, mm, it's Tromix in 4K and it's Logical Pencils. How are you, Logical Pencils? It's so good to see you. <clears throat> Tromix, welcome. How are you? We're going to add some chat commands really quick and then we'll go to space. So here's the first one. Let me see where it is. This one. <laughs> what should this one be called? I did it! Fabric chart do 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 do. Fabric chart do 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 do. Listen, Tromix, I have met so many people that also love Outer Wilds. So I'm going to get to it in just a second. I have to add these new commands and then... Evil did it. <gasps> I did it. Chaos did it. <laughs> okay, did we'll do. We'll do. I evil did it. it. We'll do. Evil did it. Okay. So now I have to add it in, and you guys can't see what I'm doing, but um, I'm gonna add those into. Um, you know what hey, I'm gonna I think you're really do. cool. I'm going I to like you a lot. Maybe we this. can hang. Tromix, thank you so much for following my channel. Oh, I gotta, I gotta talk like I'm from Minnesota now. Um, I'll start that in just a second. Oh, my timer did go off. Okay, good. Good, good. All right, so we're going to call this Evil, well, Evil Did It. And then we're going to add a trigger for it, which is going to be the same thing. Gotta do this in streamer bat. Oh, whoops. Oh, I guess I can just copy that. Post it. Okay. Will it work? Will it blend? Okay, somebody try it. Somebody try it. Evil did it. Exclamation point. Big brain time. Mm. I know what happened. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. That's why. Big brain time. I did not put the... Hold on. Okay, stop. I thought I knew what I was doing, and I was wrong. Okay, evil did it. Okay, here it is. Um. Good night. Um, I don't know how long it is. I think it's like eight seconds, maybe. Okay, try again. Try again. Hey, it's Alkan Rose and randomness. Randomness, Rick. How are you? Hello. What the heck? Why is it not working? Oh, probably because. Uh, why am I having so many? Pro oh, that's why. Okay. All right. One more time. Evil did it. <laughs> I did it. Yay. All right. That one works. That one works. That's good. Oh, it's not eight seconds. It's like five seconds. We're unstoppable! Oh, thank you. You know what? You are so nice because I literally got out of the shower and like, I didn't know what to do because <laughs> so about a year, almost a year ago, I fellas, it! it's been almost a year. I shaved off the sides of my head for Extra Life, like charity. And, um... I thought I was going to love it, and I just didn't really love it. So I was like, okay, well, we tried, and it was for sick kids, and I got some, I donated some money for some sick kids. It was totally worth it. But I've had it growing out, so I have these pieces of hair all along here that are, like, this long, and they're just, like, out there. So I washed my hair today, and I don't own a, a blow dryer because my blow dryer crapped out, and it crapped out literally, like, the day I took my mom's blow dryer to Goodwill. After I did that. So uh, I 
got out of the shower and I was like, I don't even know what to do with my hair. I can't dry it. So I did these little, you can't see them. I covered them up, but I did these little like French braids down the side. And then I wanted to do something that would not give me a headache. So I'm glad you like my hair. That's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to say. Okay, one more command here. One more command and then we'll go to space. It's Michael. How are you, Michael? Yeah, I, um, that's true. I didn't go like full shield maiden, but, um, I just, I just, I didn't love it. I didn't love it as much as I thought I was going to. I was kind of sad about it, but I would have always questioned if I was, if I was going to love it. So, you know, uh, okay. This one is, I think Napsy had it right. He said no dying. <laughs> no dying today. No, no sorry. So exclamation point, no dying. Or no dying today. No dying. I'm going to just call it no dying. <laughs> I did it. Hey, it's Lindsay. Thank you so much for the lurk. We're going to change this to... Uh, no dying. Yes. Um. Because <laughs> I don't have a way to listen. Why do you have a way to listen? That makes me so sad for you. Um. No dying. Where is it? No dying. I don't know how long that one is either, but it's DJ. Why is Aloy running the stream? My hair doesn't look that much different, do I? Does it? I did my little like, this is called a quaff, I think. Anyway, my hair's all wet and I don't want to blow dry right now. So <laughs> that, was the only, that was the only way I could get it to look somewhat, somewhat like, let's see, no dying. Oh, come on. Man, I would love to be Aloy for Halloween. That would be so fun. My mother-in-law did say she could make the Zelda dress and I could just wear like a like a nude leotard. So that might be happening, which is very exciting. Okay. Oh wait, I think it's longer than three and a half seconds. Do four seconds. Okay, it should just be no dying. Oh, nope. Sorry, I had to turn it back on. <laughs> Is that does that work for everybody? No mm. I think it's six seconds. I guess I should just look that up. Um <laughs> Well, I could be Zelda, I could be Pura, I could be Um I kind of thought about going as No dying today, no sorry. Oh, almost, man. I should probably just look up how long it is. I'm gonna do 65. Sorry, I'm thinking out loud. I was gonna go as Goldie from uh, Puss in Boots because Charlotte really wanted to go as Puss in Boots, but now Charlotte hasn't made it up her mind. She may wanna go as a Korok. And I thought Auden would be really cute as a Korok. So I thought, well, oh, I should just be Zelda, but I could do Pura as well. I don't know. I really love the idea of going as Zelda, but then at the same time, I'm also yeah, like, you know what? One year. We went as, I went as Little Red Riding Hood, Ander went as the hunter, and Charlotte went as the wolf. And I made her a little wolf hoodie. And she wore that hoodie for like a year after that. I put like teeth and ears and eyes like on the hood. And it was so cute. And it was just kind of a twist on, you know, the regular classic Little Red costume. And we could very easily do that this year. So I don't know. <laughs> That's too... <laughs> Okay, I'm sure I missed a whole bunch of things. No, no, I think the Zelda command is just on um, uh, cooldown. I don't remember how long the cooldown is, but I think that's I think that's the case. It's oh, it's there. It's just on cooldown. So we've got two new commands. Mm. It looks like a wig from the French Renaissance. Okay, so you guys can kind of sort of see. I did this kind of like little French braid thing, which the right side was a heck of a lot easier than the left side. The left side, my brain got all twisted up and I was like, oh, over, under, over, under. I could not remember which way I was going. So this side looks a lot worse than this side. But I actually really love that look of like, 
you have to have volume up here, right? So like Aloy, she has those like twists that go back, but she's holding them in place with, I don't know, because they didn't have bobby pins back then, I imagine. But um, uh, she has like this kind of like Viking, kind of like these lifted twists and braids up here, but then her the sides of her head are a little, are like close to her head. And she has these little twists and these little braids that go back into her hair. And I really love the way that looks because if you're gonna have flat on the side, you need to have lift up here and it gives your face that elongation. Um, but I haven't had long enough hair to do that until like right now. But even so, the hair is like meep, like this long. <laughs> so anyway. Uh, let's get over to my volume controls because it is loud in my headphones. Turn that down and then we'll head on over. Can confirm, my brain got all twisted up. <laughs> my brain was like, uh, uh, uh. oh my gosh, I saw a picture the other day. Somebody was wearing a beanie that had been knitted to look like a brain. I would absolutely buy one if I could. It was like, had all the little like curly like ridges and stuff like that. It was so fun, I loved it. I was like, where do I get a knitted beanie, a brain beanie? Hey, it's Red, how are you? Mm. I have actually have a couple, um, oh, wrong controller. I have a few YouTube, um, like tutorials. Uh, you know what I just realized? This was supposed to be in rest mode, but <sighs> whatever, it doesn't matter. Where was I? I was on, uh, where was I? I was on Giant's Deep, pretty sure. Is that what it's called, Giant's Deep? Yes, yes. Um, oh, I'm so sorry, Red. Dude, I had COVID a couple weeks back. Like, I I am so sorry. I don't wish that kind of I don't wish that kind of stuff on anyone. <gasps> I think I went to the wrong account. That's why. I went to the wrong account. Okay, hold on. Uh how do I sign out? That's right, because I have two accounts on here. Home. We're gonna switch accounts. That one. Apparently it's the one with the bow and arrow, everybody. One with the bow and arrow. That's supposed to be the one that I have saved. Yeah, yeah, yes. Oh, that's right, I'm like in the thing. Mm. I'm in like the probe thing. Landrider's like, okay, I have your current death count as I understand it and will update it as you continue. Feel free to remind me if I forget one. Chances are I will also forget one. Jordachi, how are you? It is good to see you. This should be the right one, right? Like, okay, yeah, all right. So, so it's the account where she's holding the bow and arrow. I need to remember that. Holding... It's not over, Bo. it's not done till it's, it's not over till it's, what? <laughs> that's when I was, uh, that's what I, I think that's right after I had COVID. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I, you know what though? I would rather, okay, Chain asked this. I was just gonna say, would you rather have an awful 24 hour bug or an inconvenient cold for two weeks? I would rather get it done and over with and be done with it in 24 hours. I would rather spend all night throwing up and be nauseous and feel awful and sick for one day, then have a cold or a cough that lasts weeks to a month. I've had residual coughs that have lasted me a month and I cannot, like, it is so, so frustrating to me. So I would much rather just be sick for one day, really sick for one day. Um. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Stomach virus or food poisoning. Now my cough isn't so bad. Ooh, Red hasn't been able to keep anything down besides herbal tea, water, and Sprite. Well, at least you can keep that down because dehydration is no joke. So I hope you get over it quickly. I really do. Do you know what um, uh, what made you sick? Although you say flu or food poisoning, so it could be either one. 
I'm not even going to talk to him. Because I'm in a time loop and he doesn't believe me. <clears throat> Can we have a command for finding the right day of the week? <laughs> yeah, I'm kind of bad at that. Because when you stay home with your kids all day, everything just all m melts together and you cannot keep heads or tails. Like, you can't. Nope, I can't keep heads or tails of what's going on in the week. Um, go easy on food for at least today and tomorrow, then soft foods. Yeah, there used to be like the brat diet, but I don't know if the brat diet is really a thing anymore. It was like brat, oh wait, bananas, rice, applesauce, toast. The problem is none of those things have fiber in them, so it can actually cause more problems because it can like cause constipation if that's all you eat. But I guess if you have the flu or you have food poisoning, constipation is probably not a problem you have. <laughs> Post-nasal drip making me cough for the past two weeks. And here's the thing. Like, you can't... You can't... Everybody's like, you need to sleep. Okay, well, if I cough all the time, I can't rest. I can't rest. You can't get better if you're constantly coughing. It's awful. Also, Jordashi got a new job. Where are you working? What 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 is this new job? <laughs> a bad stomach bug can make you stop coughing if you know what I mean. All right, space. Let's go. What is what is this place called? Timber Hearth. Yeah. Okay. Okay, I think we're out of the atmosphere. So, so, I'm supposed to go to Brittle Hollow because there's something there, but every time I set foot anywhere on there, it launches me into a black hole. Alcandro says, my data structures and algorithms professor and my calculus professor were arguing the other day about who will fail half the class first. <laughs> um, uh... <laughs> bratwurst. <laughs> yes, have some bratwurst. No, don't. Ah! <laughs> I just went into the sun! <laughs> I didn't realize I was still moving! I thought my game paused when you were in the map, but you did not! <laughs> Death by incineration from the sun. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? <laughs> I actually think you can like, I think you can change that. <laughs> Flight. No. <laughs> There's somewhere in there where it says you can no like, dying, you can change that. Oh, no it's graphics. Sorry. Oh my gosh, that was very funny. <laughs> oh, oh no, it's here. Advanced. No. Yeah, yeah. Freeze time while translating text. Freeze time while talking to others. Freed oh, not in map mode. Okay, apparently I was wrong. I was totally wrong. <laughs> Jordachi says, I'll be delivering for a distribution company. Better hours Thanks, and way more money. I'll be done by 3.30 every day. That sounds like heaven. I'm off to an incredible start. The map cannot be paused as it shows things in real time. Okay. Uh, okay. Um, <laughs> yeah, well, oh no, that's not what I meant. Okay. Okay. I don't know much about this game either, Jordachi. I came into this not having a clue what I was doing and I still don't really know what I'm doing. Although yesterday we did make some discoveries, but we're kind of in, it's kind of like a time loop. Like every time I die, I wake up right there next to the campfire, but the guy that's next to me in the campfire doesn't believe me. I've only met one other person that believes me. He's like, so I've been dying a lot lately. Have you been dying a lot lately? I'm like, yes, I have. Hey, Nepsy, do I like Nickelback? No, I do not love Nickelback. The f The best part of a Nickelback song I've ever heard is when he starts singing about being a rock star and the guy in the background goes, I'll have a quesadilla. <laughs> that just makes me laugh every time. I don't like Nickelback much, no. 
Nickelback or Creed. Those were just not, those were just not my jam. I didn't really appreciate those. <laughs> yeah, look at this giraffe. Okay, I'm in map mode. Map is happening in real time. I got pulled into a gravitational pull of some sort. I need to find, um, I need to find the two other islands on Giant's Deep. Mm. I was reading your highlighted messages and then I ran into the sun. Safe to tell you this now, this game does not save in the middle of the time loop. It only saves once you've died and restarted the loop. Oh, where is Giant Steep? Well, what do you know? There it is. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Abort, 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 abort. Ah! Oh my gosh. Okay. Well, there was a, an island. There's another one. Just yeeted out into space. Okay. Hey. I don't think I've been on that one yet. Okay, I'm gonna pause. Thus, when you quit last time, you hadn't finished the loop, meaning that it's possible your progress for the loop wasn't saved. Um, I didn't quit the game. I put my PlayStation in rest mode, but then when I pulled it up, I don't know what happened, but either way, I, I think I knew that it didn't save. It's kind of like Stardew Valley. You can't save in the middle of a day. You have to save at like the end of the day. You have to like go to bed and then your progress is saved. This doesn't save in the middle of a time loop, so. Okay, I have not finished all my work on that thing, but it's okay. It's all right, we'll get there. It's all right, okay. Oh no, I wanna go on there. <laughs> okay, okay. Okay. Have I been on here yet? This looks spooky. Uh, uh, uh. Uh. That was a rough landing, kind of. Oh, this is good. This is, f this is, I don't think I've been here before. And my ship isn't damaged now, so that's good. Ghost matter? I beg your pardon. What? Yes, the game says every time you die. So every time you wake up, the game has already saved. I did explode in that fiery flash yesterday. That is true. Okay. I do not. What is ghost matter? What the heck? Ah! 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 What is it? Oh my gosh! What the heck is ghost matter? Is my door closed? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Why? What was that? And what is that? <gasps> what is that? That thing just launched. That's the... No, I don't want to hint yet. Okay, all right, okay. I feel like I've been playing for how long now and I feel like I haven't made it very far at all. Okay, okay. So right at the beginning of the time loop, it, that probe thing sent something out into space and it looked like I could land on it. <laughs> it's ghost matter, probably, maybe, not really. Not as so much. You've just learned to pause and to fear ghost matter. Yeah, I did do that, didn't I? Okay, okay. What? What did Giant's Deep launch out into the 
space. The Creed and the Clean Creed clone days were a pretty dark time for rock music. But hey, they're someone's favorite band. Yeah, like they they had a lot of fans. Yeah, that thing launched something. There's an island just coming out into space and then going right back down. Mm. Love me some spice. Those purple eyes. Oh, oh, okay, okay, okay. I think, I think. Okay, there's a, an island. Oh, this is new. Okay. Oh, oh. <coughs> it's in landing mode. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. We're good. I am the banana. Um. <laughs> this is new. It's all new. Everything. Wait a minute. Were we just launched out into space again? Oh, here we go. Okay. Okay. Okay, this is the, this is the, oh, I remember this place. I was on my way here when a big cyclone came and lifted my ship away. Okay. Dog, pig, Ooh. dog, pig, dog, pig, <gasps> loaf of bread. Oh, what is that? What are you? You are a door and you would need a key of some sort. Oh, no. Statue workshop. Oh, we found Statue Island. Bet we did. Wait, wait. How can I just open the door? <laughs> Spice up your life! Now I gotta talk, not say my owls. My Hello? owls. Well, um, how, how do I fly? That's as high as I can go? That, how, how do I even make it back to my ship? One of these situations. <gasps> okay. What? Follow the lights. Oh. Ah, oh, weird. <laughs> this is so weird. <laughs> Skeletons. Ghost metal? No. At least your ship tells you, or your suit tells you. Ghost metal. What am I? <laughs> hey, wait. <laughs> Pseudo. Pseu Pseudo. Pseudo pseudo hypo parathyroidism. Pseudo pseudo hypo parathyroidism. <laughs> Thyro thyroid. Ooh, Oreo. Oreo. Nothing bunt cake. Sounds amazing. Hypothyroidism. Okay. Really sure. 
what we're doing here. Oh. Okay. Um, they're going to test the memory statues tonight. Fox says it could be dangerous, so we can't come. But what if we didn't use the doll and snuck in the other way? Does anyone want to? Fox specifically told us not to do that. You sound like teenagers. I really want to see the test too, Wami. <laughs> but that's a huge risk to take. We probably shouldn't. Maybe Flox will let us see a later test. Dangerous. That makes me highly uncomfortable. Okay. There's stuff down there. Wait, what? I can launch a scout down there? How do I see what's going on with the scout? <laughs> this accent works with these notes. Okay, wait, what? I'm supposed to get down there. How do I get down there? Something's happening. Oh. Oh, I thought that was a hole. Um. <laughs> Can't get. Oh. Is this where I came in? I can't even remember. Whoa, no, this is new. Play it forward gaming! Mega gravity, oh! That. That makes sense. Oh! No, stay down. I was gonna say, I thought I was able to like fly around. But this is, that's, <gasps> can we, okay, here we go, all right, it's good. <laughs> I, can't, I don't know if I can get up on this thing, on this ridge, on this thing. What do you do? What's, oh, that's a thing, okay. <sighs> yeah, from high gravity to zero gravity. How are you, Plant Forward Gaming? You must be an Outer Wilds fan. I'm a fan of it, but I'm very confused. I have lots of questions. <laughs> but it's okay, it's okay. We're having a real good time. Oh, okay, follow this line. Who would choose to work on this planet? Like who would be like, yeah, that's a great planet to do our work on, 100%. Let's build a statue there. Nobody, 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 nobody would. This is a terrible planet, and this doesn't make any sense. Oh, there's just an island. It's going. Woo, favorite game of all time. That is very high praise. Hmm. Diabetes. <laughs> my mom, my stepdad actually. <gasps> oh no, wait, that's where I came in. Uh, my mom actually, my stepdad had diabetes and my mom used to call it diabetes. And I was like, is that really what it's supposed to be called? I don't think so. I don't, I don't know what this is. I remember seeing that somewhere. Fireballs. Okay, so it's official. I don't have a clue what to do here, so. I see no statue. I don't see a wheel. Or three more wheels. 
Yes, I do remember that Jay has diabetes, which is, must be a real struggle. I'm sorry for that. My stepdad had diabetes um, and he really just did not take care of himself. He was very, he would get like recommendations from his doctors to take care of himself and they would be like, listen, you can't eat these foods or you can't do this or whatever. And then he'd be like, oh, well, those are just guidelines. Were they though? I don't think so. <laughs> I think. I think those doctors were trying to save your life. He eventually just let himself go and uh, passed away from it. But he was, he would not take care of himself. It was incredibly frustrating for everyone involved. Maybe there's a thing to put in the thing to open the other thing to retrieve your thing. Seems right. I agree, 100%. There's a thing where that I put in the thing to get to the thing so I can go to the thing. Yeah, I think you're right. Problem is, I can't find the thing to put in the thing. So there's just supposed to be a statue here. Oh, that was a leaf. I thought it was, and daddy! He took my boot. How do I get down there? That's what I want to know. Maybe if I... Oh no, I think that's the way I came. Monkey. Little baby monkey. I hate gravity! <laughs> so much. I can't go anywhere. I need to go down there. No. Oh, retrieve the scout. So many questions. Ah, <laughs> Doctor Who Bill. <laughs> there's a there's a a statue. There's a secret place. <gasps> oh, there's a oh, there it is. It's right there. Do I go under the island and then ascend up into this area? I hear a tornado coming. It's going to launch me into the sky. Not even the sky. It's going to launch me into space. Methyl chloro isothiazolino one. <laughs> what? <laughs> Methyl chloro. Methyl chloro. Meth methyl. No. Me not methyl. Methyl chloro isothiazolinone. That's the best you're gonna get. Yeah, there is a statue. Oh, yep, here we go. Down. What just happened? Whoa. I am glitching. Oh, oh, oh my. Oh, those things are there and they like keep you s s like grounded. Oh, those go off in space. What? Can I like, no, I'm not gonna ask that question. Yes, I will, hypothetically. Can I like travel between them? Like, like, don't answer that. Okay, oh, this is where I came in. Pretty sure, yep, yes. Tornado shelter, okay, that makes sense. I found those things on another island That was wild. Okay. So. There's like a place down. Oh, here we go. That was a mistake. Ah! Oh, crap. Dang it. 
Yeah, I- okay. I do not want to go down there. I know I'm gonna have to at some point, but I do not want to do that at all. Okay, let's get back to our ship, shall we? Where is our ship? Where is my ship? <laughs> oh, everything is terrible. Okay, all right. Now we're hovering above the water. Okay. Okay, well... Question is everything. Everything is a question. <laughs> um, two brawling squirrels in my yard just went at it, and one launched the other out of the tree. <laughs> Yeeted like these islands. <laughs> I'm so glad we don't live with squirrels. Oh my gosh, we had squirrels in Austin, and they are so obnoxious. Oh, I forgot to talk about this yesterday. You guys saw the picture of the chicken my dog found in our yard? Yeah, yeah. We don't own chickens. I don't know where my dog found it. <laughs> Bye, Land Rider! <laughs> yes, that's the one question. That's just the question. Why is those things? <laughs> that's just the question. There has to be a way to, like, get down in that area. So we're gonna, we're gonna fly around. <sighs> Oh, these camera angles. Oh, okay. Okay. There has to be a way to get into that area. There's got to be. There has to be. Oh, I see it! Oh. Down! No, I pushed up. Okay. Hold on. Yeah, yes. Ugh! Landing mode! What does landing mode even do? True North, how are you? True North, you are great. Stop it. Stop. Look at look at you. Look at you. You are great. How are how are things? You know what gave me that idea? Tears of the Kingdom. When there is no way down, there is probably a way up. Maybe. I don't know. I sound like I know what I'm talking about. I don't. <laughs> I don't know. I was just thinking, well, it's like down in the rock somewhere. There's got to be a way to get down there. Okay, so what happens when we get yeeted into space? <laughs> yeah, we did it. We found a way. We found a way. Oh, oh. Yeah, no, I... <gasps> Perfect. I did it! <laughs> okay. Did oh no, I'm not gonna I make that. It? Okay, ready? <laughs> we did it. Yeah. Oh, here's a tornado shelter. Oh. Hey, we found it. We found something. <laughs> Yara, would you kindly I step back so Daz it. is closest to the statue? When pairing, like Bluetooth. The statue will choose whoever is the closest is in closest proximity. <gasps> I just realized there are pages. Oh, maybe only on this one. See how its eyes have opened? That tells us the statue has paired with Daz. I've paired with the statue. Now, no matter where he is in this star system, Daz's statue will record his memories and send them to the Ash Twin Project. A what now? This is extraordinary sculpting work, Flox. He has outdone himself again, hasn't he? And now that we have our first successful pairing, we can test my memory storage prototype. Each statue will send a simple gnomize memories to his or her own storage unit within Ash Twin. Each storage unit will be equipped with a mask, the statue's counterpart, which will be able to send <laughs> Sorry. Those stored memories back to the corresponding Nomai. What? You. You. I can't pair with you because I've already been paired. Listing my house this weekend. Ah! Ah! Tornado! Oh, man. Okay. 
There goes my ship. Oh, there goes my ship. Ah! Here goes everything. Oh, wow. Okay. So, were they goats? Medusa goats? Oh, it's up there. My poor ship. <laughs> okay. Oh, wait. But there was another thing. There was another place that had, like, writing on the walls. I don't know where it was. I think it was... Oh, it's probably up this way. Man, I'll tell you what. I am nervous for someday when we sell our house. Because, oh, yeah. Ash Twin Projection Stone. Okay, we're gonna read this. It just seems very stressful. Buying a house is really stressful, but selling a house also seems very stressful. I've installed the masks inside the Ash Twin Project flocks. They look beautiful, although I do feel as though I'm being observed. It's comforting to know the statues will not pair until the project succeeds. Otherwise, I imagine the experience would be hard to endure. Okay, well, if I've already paired with a statue, that means the project did, did succeed. Ideally, they'll only need to activate once the project succeeds. As a safety measure, however, the statues will also activate in the event of an equipment failure. Like I flew into the sun. They will? Why is that? If anything goes wrong with the Ash Twin Project, the statues and their masks will make us aware of the situation and enable us to fix it. Otherwise, it would be possible for us to remain permanently unaware of the problem. I hadn't thought of that. What a profoundly horrific fate that would be. Endymium, how are you? It's so good to see you. So, so, so when they say... Ash Twin Projection Pool, or whatever. This is gonna send me somewhere else. Ah! Oh, I don't like this at all. Where is this? Ooh, that's gonna, wow, okay, okay. Take, take it off, stop it, turn it off. Turn it off! Where's the thing? Here it is. Wow, wow, that was really intense. Walking home from the bus stop after being out and about in the town. What's the weather like there right now? It's seriously been so nice today, you guys. It's been rainy. Pause, so I don't, like, die. Whoa! See? It says it's 81, but when we woke up this morning, it was 70 degrees, and it was wet, and it was very rainy, and it was heaven. This Saturday, for Charlotte's birthday, it's supposed to be a low of 71 and a high of 82. Can you imagine a more perfect birthday? Clear sky, nighttime, about 15 to 17 Celsius. Uh, what is that in Fahrenheit? I can't remember what that is in Fahrenheit. Oh, up there! That's where I need to go. I haven't read that yet. How do I get up there? Wait, wait. Oh no, that's where I came in. No. Music starting! This music reminds me of the never ending story. <laughs> I'm keeping my eye on a hurricane that might hit the east coast of Canada. Well, I would keep my eye on, if I lived there, I would too. Are you kidding? Have I already read that up there? Have I already been up there? No, I don't think I have. I don't believe this early autumn. I agree. It's going to stab us all in the back. Yep, can confirm. Okay, we're going to, we're going to, like, buckle up, buttercup, and we're going to, like, oh my gosh, that happened a lot faster. Oh, 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 oh my gosh, camera angles are terrible. Oh, have I already been there? Oh. This is the worst. Okay, 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 okay. Careful. Calm down, Susie. Just simma done now. Have I already been up there? I can't tell. I think my ship is too big. 
Everything sounds scary. Oh, there are stairs. I think I have been up there. Are we in space? <laughs> Official fall starts here around October 20th. Leaves don't change until the first week of November. Hey, it's Brooklyn! How are you? I think we're about to hit the... Oh no, we're gonna die! Oh crap, okay, so you're timed. I think I discovered this yesterday. You are timed. Something happens in the ocean from that missing piece of the probe that's down there that like totally eliminates like the entire planet and ends the time loop and starts you over. So that means we need to get up to the broken probe because that's where I ended yesterday. I ended, I had done number one and I needed to go to the second part of the probe. There's a hole in your roof? I am so sorry. This game indeed. I've never played a game quite like this. It is extremely unique. First time I played it, I wasn't feeling great and the camera angles and everything made me really sick and I had to sign off early and I was really sad about it. This game was actually gifted to me by one of my lovely viewers. It's here. And uh, <clears throat> so I was really scared I wasn't gonna be able to play it, but I was like, I refuse to give up on this game. I had just gotten over COVID. I was still, I still don't feel 100%. Where are you? Here you are. Every, I was gonna say morning. Every time I wake up, something gets shot out of that broken probe. Bilbo, mystery in the dark. But I don't know how to find it. How the heck am I supposed to find that out in this entire <laughs> galaxy? There's a probe in the bottom of the sea. There's a probe in the bottom of the sea. There's a probe. There's a probe. There's a probe in the bottom of the sea. Uh, okay. That. That's what I'm trying to get into. Okay. 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 Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Down. No. Yeah! Oh, take it! No! Match velocity! Match velocity! Oh, come on! Oh! What? We're just... Why? Oh, okay! Yeah! Alright. We did it. Way to go. Uh, Collector says, it's quite fun watching a game that you know nothing about, and I also know nothing about. Mysteries at every turn! It's a mystery. It's a mystery. It's a mystery for everybody. Oh, whoops. I totally understand Endymium. I feel that. We're gonna go... Down. Down. <sighs> We're gonna nab this little guy. We're gonna go like that. Uh huh. Yeah. And then we're gonna go to number two. Because, because I think we did number one. I don't remember anything happening in particular, but. Okay. Oh, what? We can't get through to number two. What? No. 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 <clears throat> BKO loves this game because it's really all about obtaining knowledge. There's really nothing you are unlocking besides learning more about the solar system. Yeah, that's certainly what it seems like. Okay. That does nothing for me. Nothing. I I thought I was supposed to like go through there. 
That looks like broken. Oh yeah, that was good. Oh, he's going away. <laughs> oh, no. <gasps> Everything's broken. Can I not like control him? Dang. And that concludes Endymium's walk. You now know how far I live from the bus stop. Please take a moment to reflect on and enjoy this information. Good night. Thank you so much for being here Endymium. It was so good to see you. I have been to Giants Deep. And I have been to, um, what's it called? Uh, Uh, Brittle Hollow, but I haven't done a whole lot in Brittle Hollow because every time I set foot anywhere, it just throws me into a black hole. So that's awesome and fun. Um, oh. Oh, 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 I understand, kind of. Okay, well, where's, um... Where's number two, then? Is that number two? Right there? Oh, I understand! Whoa, what is this? Oh, um, no, that's the tunnel that I went down into. Maybe? Uh. Question mark. No, down. No, ship. No, where? What? <laughs> okay, that's Giant's Deep. Oh, oh, it's flying away from me. Where's my ship? <laughs> it is. Okay, okay. Um. Ugh. Yeah, okay. So, number two is broke. I don't know how, you know what? And let me read my ship log. Let's do that. That probably, that seems like a good idea. Interloper, Brittle Hollow, Timber Heart, and Giant's Deep were visited. Oh yeah, I did visit the Interloper. That's right. I, I couldn't figure out anything what to do there. It's just very icy. But I know Brittle Hollow has... Okay, wait. How do I zoom? Okay. Well, hello. Um, this <laughs> island must be where the Nomai created statues like the one in our observatory. I found a Nomai statue lying on the beach. Oh, that's right. Nomai statues were designed to pair with a single user record their memories, and then send those memories to a storage unit within the Ash Twin Project. What? <laughs> Each storage unit inside the Ash Twin Project was equipped with a mask. The statue's counterpart. Oh! Okay, I know what the masks are. Which could then send those stored memories back to the corresponding user. Statues were designed to only deact only activate once the Ash Twin project. How come I can't scroll? Oh. Uh, succeeded or in the event that it failed. So is the Ash Twin project the time loop then? <laughs> How does it feel to be owned by potassium? Every memory recorded by a Nomai statue is transmitted to a corresponding storage unit within Ash Twin. What is Ash Twin? Where is Ash Twin? We don't know. Oh, what? Ash Twin? What is this? Ember Twin? Oh, I beg your pardon. Mm -hmm. Oh! There are these twins! Oh, and goodness. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, 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 okay, yeah, no, I knew that. I don't think we can do anything with this area 
until um, I went to the interloper, but there was nothing there. Like, it was just... It was just icy everywhere. Okay, that is what? What is that? Is that dark bramble? Because I'm scared of dark bramble. No. The hub to the hub. That's giant seed. Okay, the hourglass twins. Those are... Ember twin. Ash twin project. Hey. I understand. Kind of. Wow, those are dangerously close to the sun. What is that? What are you? Oh, you're Brittle Hollow. Oh! Oh! Yeah, yeah! Ash Twin! Yes! Oh, no! Ah! Oh! Oh! I just ah! I'm gonna die! Dang it! Yeah! Yeah! Oh! Oh! Okay, can we land somewhere? Land, yeah, 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 yeah. Land, land, land. Oh. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. Master alarm. What is happening? Why is everything dark? What happened? Remind me to never get in a spaceship with you if you are driving. Oh yeah, no. Everything is dark. I, oh. Oh, I understand, mm, kind of. Oh, everything is broken. It is a bad situation. Okay, all right. Oh my gosh, half my ship is missing. Ah! Oh my gosh, I'm just in the little, what? Oh my, am I, am I on? <laughs> yeah, straight up. Where am I going? Oh, there's my ship. Oh my gosh. Wow. There it is. There she is. She, she gone. She, she donezo. Something's, <gasps> what are you? Oh my gosh! Hide! It's gonna pick my ship up. What the heck is the matter with these planets? <laughs> yes, is this the Gerudo Desert? Oh man, I don't have any, I can't. Oh, maybe I can. No, I cannot. Okay, okay, uh, I don't think there's any salvaging my ship. But that's the ash. Well that just deals my pickles. Where am I? I'm on the Ember Twin. Okay, that's what I thought. Oh, and it's nighttime now. That's fair. If it walks like a furnace and quacks <laughs> like a furnace, it's a furnace. It's a furnace. <clears throat> well, I'm going to... Oh, okay. There is something up there. Yeah, I knew oh, it. Oh, here it comes oh, you again. Are all insane. save my ship. I think I'm just, I think the ship is, okay, let's back up. Back it up. Back it up, Terry! Back it up! Yeah, I was gonna say, I'm sure the ship is out. Take it, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it! Which is fine. You know, time loop and all. Dang it. Dang it! But I can't actually... Oh, yes, I can. Oh, okay. We're going in here, wherever this is. Get on out of here. 
This is the weirdest setup. There's just a... Oh, no, sir. I... Okay. Well, we knew that was going to happen. <gasps> Unidentified signal. Okay. 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 Don't get dehydrated. You're going to run out of oxygen anyway. Aw, oh, man. Oh. <laughs> okay, fine. Wow. Wow. <laughs> oh! This rock is very familiar. Did you travel here, my sedimentary friend? Because your unique color and texture appears identical to a rock I met earlier. We're talking to rocks. <laughs> Wasn't this the same rock fragment in the cave we found at the bottom of the dry lake bed at the North Pole? We plan to re-examine the northern lake bed cave. Maybe our friendly rock will meet us down there. Okay, we're not lonely then. An update. Melor, Meloray and I went back to the lake bed cave and observed this rock again. Sometimes it's there and sometimes it isn't. What? That means this rock wanders like the quantum moon does. How curious. Um, okay. Coleus is missing. He vanished from the lake bed cave, the one at the bottom of the dry lake bed at the North Pole, several days ago, and were unable to find any trace of him. I don't know how much air he had when he disappeared. I beg any friend reading this, help us recover Coleus. Okay, so... So someone is in the same boat as me. <laughs> okay. <gasps> Wilson! Did any of you cry when Wilson floated away? That was rough, man. Can you smell what that rock is cooking? <laughs> okay. Oh. Yeah. I knew that was going to happen. Totally. Okay. So, um. So. There is somebody I have to find. And there's an unidentified signal nearby. Is that... Uh. 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 Stop moving forward. So not a lot of oxygen. So there's somebody that's missing at a lake bed cave, which sounds horrifying. Can confirm. Okay, there's nothing over here. Oh yeah, I'm dying. I don't know how I survived that crash. Should have just wiped me out. Anything? Anything? Oh. Something. Yeah. I'm gone. And I'm down. Yay! New objective! Okay, so a lake bed. Those are the masks. Whoa, I just hit my desk. Those are the masks. Because those look different than the actual statues. So the statue, each statue has a mask. <laughs> How does it feel to be owned by potassium? So. <laughs> okay. I'm trying to keep all this straight. Yeah, see? There it goes! Oh my gosh! We just watched it break. So, so when you first wake up, it's intact. And then it shoots off its cannon. It, it shoots the cannon and then the whole thing explodes. We've got to go find whatever it shot off. First I have to pee. My Dr. Pepper. Give me... 30 seconds. I'll be right back. 
Yeah, I just noticed it was all together as one piece and then it shoots something and then it all, it breaks up into pieces. That's what breaks it. So, okay, all right, let me run to the bathroom. I'll be right back. Death by pee break. <laughs> Can happen if you don't go to the bathroom often enough and you get a um, UTI. Yeah, that can kill you if you don't get it. If you don't get it taken care of. Um, <clears throat> okay, Jay says, can confirm, lost at a lake bed cave. Terrifying. My brother is the head of San Juan County Search and Rescue in Utah, and he's told me some stories. I actually have a friend. She's um, in our Discord um, she doesn't tune into streams very often, but she actually lost her best friend ever in the world due to getting her friend getting stuck in a cave. They went spelunking or whatever as a group and she drowned in the cave because there was she literally drowned in like this much water, but she couldn't get I, I don't know exactly what happened, but it was absolutely horrifying. Have any of you seen The Descent? I haven't. But once again, you could not pay me enough to go spelunking either. So. So that thing that the cannon launches is not actually on the map. Oh yeah, no, no. Getting lost in a cave? Like, absolutely not. No. <laughs> nope, nope. Absolutely not. Won't do it. Will not. I have been to Timp Caves in Utah. Timpanogos Caves. Those are really cool. But those are done by, like, a tour guide. There are railings everywhere. Obviously, probably, there are some people that don't follow the rules. And I don't know if anybody's been lost at Timpanogos Cave. But um, I would never just go in, like, alone. Yeah, no. That's, that's awful. Does your brother need, like, therapy for that? Go to counseling for that? I imagine that would be so, so messed up. That would really mess your head up. Okay, so if we're gonna zoom here, there's something circling around the sun. Those are the hourglass twins. Brittle hollow. What is hollow's lantern? Okay, hold on. I gotta make sure I'm not gonna <laughs> get crunched into the sun or something. Okay, okay. So, so, I don't even know how to find it. What direction did it go? If that's Giant's Deep and that's the thing, what is this? What is, what is it? What is it? What does it call itself? Nothing. It just says giant steep. Okay. Um. I don't think it's on the map. I think we just have to like randomly find. Oh, what are you? Nope. That's just a star. Okay, fine. I don't have claustrophobia, but watching someone drown or being stuck as entertainment. Yeah, no, no, sorry. That sounds terrible. There's the interloper. Yeah, that's the interloper. Yes, that is Brittle Hollow. That's Brittle... Oh, that's Hollow's Lantern. What are you? 
That's dark bramble, but look, there's like a thing going around it or away from it. Yeah, what is that? Yeah, there's something that gets shot from that cannon. Where are you? I don't know what you are. Oh, dark bramble looks scary. No way. What is that? What is that? What? What? Why? What is that? I don't understand. It looks like it's some sort of like... Maybe not a black hole, but like a light hole? I had a hard enough time with reading about the guy who got stuck in Nutty Putty Cave. Yeah, no. Uh-uh. You could not pay me enough money to go freestyle climbing, spelunking down into... Mm -mm, in a cave? No. Okay, so what happens if I like launch myself into this thing because I can't lock onto it. I don't know what you are. Are you what got shot out of that thing? Ugh. Uh, oh, but it does have like pieces of something on it. Yeah. What are you? What are you? Okay, well, apparently I can log on to that randomly. Sounds great. Uh, abort, 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 abort! Ah! Mr. Floop! Floyd Collins? I do not know the story of Floyd Collins. Is it going to terrify me? Is this? What is it? What is it? Camera's getting weird. Whoa. What? It's nothing. It's just like a... Ugh. Camera's getting weird, guys. Okay, okay, so it's just this random ball of light. So... Is that what... The... Oh, no, that's something. What is that? Are there multiple galaxies in this? Or... Um... Do you just... Are you... Do you just stay in the same galaxy? Is this? What is this? What is this? Ah, I can't land it. <sighs> okay, down slowly, 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 slowly. Eh. Okay, kind of made it on here, but it's sketchy, and I don't like it at all. Can I unbuckle? I don't think so. What is this thing? Okay, well, I don't think I can land on that. Maybe. Question mark. There's a tree! What? Okay, lots of questions there. I don't know. Floyd Collins, was he somebody who, um, like, died in a cave or something like that? Darth Plagueis the Wise? I hear something. What is it? Ah! Ah! I don't know what that is. It's just a big piece of rock. Floating around. Okay. Okay. Looking for, like, a thing. Oh, what are you? Is that what... It shot out? No. Maybe? Okay. Oh. Oh. I don't know what this is, but it looks exciting. Oh, no, it looks scary! Ah! Oh. Okay. Down. Down. Oh. Okay, am I, like, landed? Okay. I'm gonna... I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Um... 
It doesn't have like a landing. Um, it's a Star Wars reference. Listen, I have not seen any of the Star. I was about to say Starburst. I have not seen any of the Star Wars movies other than like the original three. One in here, whatever this is. This looks, oh my gosh, yeah, 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 yeah. This is the thing that launched and, ah, there we go. What? Trees detected. Oh, man. Oh, no, 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 okay. Um, yes, he was. A really gripping story. The internet historian originally did a long version of it, but he had to take it down. <sighs> Any sort of, like... Okay, what is... Okay. Yeah, the idea of, like... I don't know. To me, when you put yourself in situations that are unbelievably dangerous without any sort of like guide or anything like that. Like if you just decide to just go spelunking without anybody who knows what they're doing. But then again, there are people who go out and do stuff like that who um, do know what they're doing and they, it's still a risk. It's still a huge risk. You can still die even if you know what you're doing. Welcome. Did I not call it a white hole? Welcome to the White Hole Station. If you fell through the black hole by accident, don't worry. You aren't the first. This warp tower can return you to Brittle Hollow. Oh. Every warp tower is tuned to a specific astral body. A tower's warp can only be used during the brief window when the tower is aligned with its corresponding astral body. In this case, Brittle Hollow. You must be standing on the warp platform on the floor during this alignment to be warped. If you look up while the station is rotating, you can see the alignment happens when the astral body is directly overhead. Okay, so this is not what shot out of the... So I have to be standing here? Warp platform? Oh, hello. Ember twin projection stone, huh? Wait, wait, what? How? I have a friend who refers to the numbered Star Wars movies as the good trilogy, the bad trilogy, and the new trilogy. Hello? <laughs> yeah, I've only ever seen the original. Oh, that's going up, and that's going down. I don't want to go down. Maybe? No, I don't want to drop this. I want to use it. Why did it give me a stone if I can't even use it? Oh, this must be glass. Oh my. Okay, not just falling into space. It's good, it's good. What is that? That's where I found the stone. Oh, so I do. <laughs> That's right. I remember now. I do have a flashlight. Uh. Be down here again with the flashlight? Oh. Um, what? I did something. I don't know what I did. We're moving. We're going somewhere. Oh my gosh, we're going to, oh wait. I thought we were going into, what, what? Are we in Brittle Hollow right now? Hey, wait. 
you. If I move you out. What? 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 Oh. oh. Okay. Oh, that is stopped by that. Okay. What does this do then? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, you guys! Can you guys see this? That's the pinata my mother in law made for Charlotte's birthday. It's amazing! I was just gonna text her today and be like, how's the pinata coming along? <gasps> That's incredible! Dude. Bokoblin pinata. <sighs> it's way better than I could have made. Wow! I'm so thrilled! Uh, that's incredible. That is absolutely amazing. I have to text her back really quick. This is... That's incredible. My mother-in-law, ladies and gentlemen. It looks so good. All right, so now I have to go to the store, buy a bunch of candy. Aren't Bacoblin guts purple? <laughs> Should probably get purple something. Yeah, yeah, I'll post it in the Discord. I'll post it in the Discord after I, you know what? I'll do it right now, because I probably will forget. I was gonna ask her, I was gonna text her today and be like, hey, uh, how's the, because she has a tendency to do things very last minute. But she got this one done, man. I'm so thrilled. Charlotte's going to be so excited. That's so cute. Oh, I love it. Okay, I just saved it. I'll upload it to the Discord. Boom, uploaded. It's so cute. I'm so excited. <laughs> Pinyoblin. I was going to make it myself, and then I decided against it. And I was like, well, I, I, I was going to ask her, well, I don't know. I worried about asking her to do it because I was like, she takes forever to do things, and she doesn't ever... I don't... Understand where this is supposed to go. Oh, what was that? Oh, this is my ship. Oh, wait. Okay, all right, cool. So my ship is just hanging out around. <laughs> just hanging out around outside. What that does, that doesn't do anything, but okay, all right, okay, well, okay. Oh, I need to get her the characters for the cake. Um, well, oh, that tells you when the thing is, like, directly above. So this is gonna... Oh, it did. For sure. Whoa. Okay. Oh! Oh! These are warp pads. Oh, I understand now. Okay, because I came across one of these on Giant's Deep. That's what that is. It's a warp pad. Oh, I understand. So where am I? Return warp status. Charged. Step onto warp receiver platform to activate return warp. Where am I now? I'm on Brittle Hollow. Oh my gosh. And this... Might as well. And this... Oh, okay. Um... This is probably the area... What am I hearing? Sounds... Sounds... Yeah, seriously. Boom. The hanging city. Below. Okay. It's kind of concerning, but okay. 
Uh, well, see, I have this projection stone. Oh, perfect. Perfect. Um, I beg your pardon. Raby and I reviewed the records you sent, Poke, and they appear to show Nomai are arriving at the warp receiver on Brittle Hollow slightly before departing from the White Hole Station. What? <laughs> I understand it's exceedingly odd, but Clary and I have tested and retested the equipment, and the result is the same every time someone warps. The interval is incredibly minuscule, roughly one hundred thousandth of a second. Do you suppose our instruments can't accurately measure time to such a small degree? As I've already told Raimi, these measurements can't be accurate. How can a Nomai arrive on Brittle Hollow before he or she ever stepped into the teleporter? The implications are absurd. I don't disagree. It would mean I've inadvertently broken several fundamental theories regarding this universe. We would have to reconsider all of our beliefs about the nature of time. Yes, I hope so too. Poke, as Pi is confident the reading is inaccurate, she's kindly helping me attempt to do recreate this phenomenon at the high energy lab. We're designing an experiment to take more to take more data. An update. Poke, the high energy lab is in the canyon on Ember Twins e Equator. Come here at once. You need to see this. Okay. This is gonna show me the Ember Twins lab, I imagine which I've been to, kind of, maybe. Oh no, I have not, wow, nope. Okay, that's... Oh, you know what? This is what I saw when I ran out of ener uh, oxygen. I saw this and then I died. So, yeah, I have- I was on my way there, I guess? Okay. okay, well, so, so, now I'm on- where am I? Brittle Hollow? Okay, that's the warp point right there. Because my ship is over, like, yonder. This doesn't look like Brittle Hollow. Brittle Hollow was, like, super fiery and red and lava-ish. Every time I went there, I just fell down into the black hole. But apparently if you fall down in the black hole... Yeah, this is all icy. The Brittle Hollow I knew that I went to was like red. Has anyone observed the phantom moon that sometimes greets us in the night sky? Your thoughts interest me. I'm interested in your playful moon. Is it much like its violent friend, Hollow's Lantern? This moon isn't volcanic to my unaided eyes. Sometimes it leaves its friend, Hollow, Hollow's Lantern for nights at a time. The nights the moon circles the planet appear random. It seems to travel as it likes. Imagine if there were two volcanic moons. Then I imagine there'd be none of us left. There. Hypothesis. There can exist too much lava. I compliment your eyes! How do you imagine it disappears? Hypothesis. Could it be a shift in the light spectrum? Suppose this moon is too shy to show us its face. Eh. I'd strongly prefer we test the null hypothesis. Okay, so there's like a... Oh, there comes a fireball. Yep, here it comes. Awesome. So... Oh! This is a North Pole! Is there a lake... Is there a lake bed cave here? What North Pole were they talking about? Because this is definitely cold. It's as cold as ice. This is Brittle Hellor, a close relative. <laughs> okay. Oh no! Oh no! Oh 
Oh no! Oh my gosh! Okay, um... Well... My ship is like forever far away, so... That's fun. Can I not? Okay. Shh, shh. Oh, ship. Is that way. Just sounded like I almost swore. My ship is that way! What's in there? Have I been in there? Uh, I guess I can just go... Oh, this is broken. Hanging city? Okay, well, there's the warp thing. Okay. I don't think I'm gonna make it, but we'll... Oh! That is so helpful. Trees! Yay, trees! Trees! Okay. Uh... What's what's my goal again? <laughs> like I don't even know. There are so many things. There's somebody stuck at a lake bed cave at the North Pole. But I don't know what North Pole they're talking about. That is definitely a North Pole of Brittle Hollow for sure. Okay, wait. Before I before I do this. Uh where is my ship? Yes. Oh, wait a minute. Can I not get out here? Oh, yes, I can. Oh, no, I can't. That's where I got in. And it closed. Oh, no. Oh, beans. Okay. All right. Well, then I guess we do have to warp, and then I just gotta, like... Wait, where are you now? Missed the past while on a call. Um, so I found the white hole warping place and then it warped me to brittle hollow but it was like a totally different it was the north pole of brittle hollow Ooh, here we go yeah so here we are at the north pole of brittle hollow which is cold 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 but there's supposed to be like a lake bed i keep wanting to say lake bed temple because lake bed temple um okay where is my ship again Know where it is. Shouldn't it be showing up on my on my where's my ship? Oh man, I'm so far away. Wait, 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 wait. Oh! I didn't go to Brittle Hollow. I went to Hollow's Lantern. No, I went to Brittle Hollow. Just kidding. Susie did not find her ship. 14th time this loop. Yep. Can confirm. Okay. I thought it showed up on my map, like, all the time. This is brutal. Yeah. Wow, I hate that so much. They're just pieces? Just, like, falling... Where's my flashlight? <laughs> oh, it was on already. <laughs> okay. How, how? What is that? Oh, it's happening. Oh, I see the launcher thing. I see the landing launcher thing. Okay, wait, 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 wait. So it's not coming from the ocean. Whatever, like, explosion crazy thing is just happening, like, just in space. And that, that, uh, signals the end of the time loop. So you really are, like, timed on how much you can do in a certain, in your certain time loop. It doesn't matter where you are. It doesn't matter where you are. It, it will automatically, see, watch. Okay, watch, watch. See the cannon up there, watch. It just shot something. Quick, quick, we gotta follow it! Quick, quick! Oh, this elevator's taking forever. Where is it? Here it is. Okay, see it? Yeah. Okay. Let's 
Spacesuit. Ah. Buckle in, buckle in, buckle in. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Where did it go? There it is. Oh, I see it. Oh, no. It looks like just all the other stars. No, but it's moving. Can I go after it? I think that's it. It looks purple. Am I supposed to go after it? That's a real question. Like, it's gone. It's traveling. Maybe I can get it on, like, another way around? Is it getting bigger? Oh, so I cannot... I can't leave... Oh, there it is! Though. It's, like, right here. Oh, no, maybe it's not. Never mind. I thought it was. Dang it. It's r it, That's it! <laughs> you didn't do all 73 pre- Pre-flight check. Wait, wait, wait. Autopilot. Why is those things? Okay, wait. So maybe I'm not supposed to go after that thing then. Because it's gone. There's no way. There's no way I can... Oh, wait. What is this? <gasps> That's it. Oh. <laughs> okay. Where did it go? We're going to lock onto that. Whatever that is. Where? Where is it? Show it to me. Oh! That's red, though. I don't know. All I'm saying is... It looks like it looks like it has a like a launcher or like a landing port on it for me. Like it's purple. Maybe I'm wrong though. Oh, you are small. What is it? I can't even tell what it is. Oh, it's a satellite or something. I beg your pardon, Autobot. Ah! <laughs> what did I do? What is that? Prima Link, how are you? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Is that what was giving me? Is that like my map? <laughs> oh my gosh, that little map shows me down there at the bottom. Okay, all right, okay. Let's do this. Unidentified signal. Yeah, yeah, it's that freaking little guy. Okay. Yeah, what are you? What's your job? Uh, uh, uh. Flying around in space. Flying around. In it. Am I supposed to fix that now? <laughs> okay. I don't know. Oh no. I did! I broke the satellite! I thought that was what the thing... It says unidentified signal nearby. I imagine it's that satellite. Right? No. Careful. Careful. Bring it in. Slow. Ah. Uh. Ah. Oh, come on. Seriously? Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> okay, there we go. Yeah, that's good. Okay, so it says unidentified signal nearby, but when I try to get near that thing, it doesn't... It doesn't let me... Oh, yeah, we made it in. I have a tool that can... Okay, so, so, so I damaged the satellite, which means I have no map anymore. Right? I did! Prima Link, I got an achievement! Silent Cartographer, whatever that means. But I did, I got an achievement. I have a tool that can check for signals? No, I did not. So I have no map. That's 
fantastic. I have a tool. Where? Well, okay, wait. Sorry, I thought that was what the thing like shot out of it. Sorry, okay, well. I'm gonna have to go get Charlotte at the bus in about 15 minutes, so. <laughs> well, you just never know. <laughs> we need to put a speaker system in the pinata. <laughs> this is an amazing pinata. Man, when my mother-in-law really puts her mind to do something, to, to doing something, she, she cannot be stopped. She's incredible. Problem is she waits so long to do things. I honestly wasn't expecting to get that pinata until the day of the party. The fact that she finished it now is shocking to me. It looks phenomenal. I'm so excited. Okay, so I'm supposed to land. Oh, I know what happened. One time I landed on the Ash Twin, I think. And I got like creamed by that giant, whatever it is. Oh, no. Okay. Oh, engage autopilot. That's what I meant. Yes, my mother-in-law made that Bacoblin pinata. Um, she is so talented, so unbelievably talented. I never did what would teach her to use it. Nope. Apparently not. I mean, I guess it doesn't matter to go here now because I'm going to have to... So... Oh, so what I need to do is I need to... Uh... I need to die. So it saves. Right? Yeah? Match velocity, match velocity, match velocity. Ah! Ah! No! Remember when I said I was gonna die? Oh my gosh! Okay, hold on. Hold on. Oh yeah, that's right. Okay, okay, okay. Is there like a landing site somewhere on here? Uh! Oh, so sorry. Yeah. Yeah, boy. We are literally just like floating around on this planet. Okay. Hold damage. Oh, maybe we're not. Okay. Okay. So, something about the Ash Twin. But it has that like super crazy. Oh, I should have refueled. Yeah. Autopilot. Yes. Ooh, here's something. Oh! There's a sun! Okay. This is this looks promising. This looks exciting. Ash project? Oh, that's where you're supposed to oh no. Okay. This looks fun. This looks Promising, maybe, question mark. Maybe. Um. Why does it look like that's literally coming out of the sand? Is there like a, oh, so there is. Whoa, oh. Oh, okay. Okay. This. Interesting. Okay. So I'm supposed to like yeet myself over to the, oh, there's my ship. No. Yes? Wait. Yes? <laughs> my ship's over there? I thought my ship was on... I thought my ship was on this... This planet. What? What happened? Okay. There it was. <laughs> yeah. Bye. 
Okay, okay. No gravity. All right, we're going this way. What is this? What's this? What's this? Oh, oh, there's stuff. Oh my gosh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Circuit coder, ship teleported. Man, I'm telling you. Oh no, oh no, oh, oh no. Okay, I need to get up there. Gravity at five. Oh. Gosh dang it, it's like right there. Oh, it's getting better. Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, yes. Ugh. Oh, okay, that's okay. All right, let's go. Oh, there are so many discoveries. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, it's 304, which means, yeah, why the heck did it suddenly land on the other one? Okay, wait, 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 wait. Before we do this, I have to go get my daughter from the bus in like 10 minutes. So that means I'm gonna yeet myself into the sun or, yep, yes, no. The big giant, oh, yeah, okay, we'll go in there. Oh no, is it coming? Where's it coming? Huh. Is it coming from that planet or is it coming from me? Oh my. Okay, here I go. Ready? It's happening. Oh, did it get. Oh, okay, well, I thought it was just gonna kill me, but. Oh, there are so many things I need to do. <laughs> we're just gonna, like. Yeah, we're gonna yeet ourselves into the sun. Oh, wow, that was really bad. Okay. Um. Uh, uh, oh, there it is again. Oh, my gosh. Okay, all right. Because I have to save, and then I got to go get Charlotte from the bus. So do my thrusters just, like, not work, or, like, what is happening? Oh, my gosh, that was horrifying. <laughs> Well, I said I wanted to die. Oh, so many discoveries. So, so is there like a, is there like a plot to this game? Or is it really just kind of discovering the mysteries of the solar system? Like, is there like an end goal? Yeah, see, boom. Yeah, Shot I knew it. Oh, you were all insane. So I'm not supposed to f f follow that. Oh, there is. Oh. Okay. Well. All right. I am so grateful that my uh, my motion sickness and everything did not carry over because um, I was really worried, but I'm, I, this game is unlike anything I've ever played. It's so interesting. I, I've never experienced anything quite like it. It's kind of like, well, I guess it's not really roguelike. Is there any way you can defend yourself? Like, I'm terrified to go to Dark Bramble, but like, are you, you know what? Don't answer that. Don't answer it. I want to go in completely blind. It'll be a good time for everybody. So, um, all I want to do is yeet myself into the sun. How hard can it be? Uh, okay. So, um, uh, this is where I will leave it for today since I have to go get Charlotte. But as always, I just appreciate, um, <laughs> I just appreciate you guys coming and hanging out with me and being so supportive. I appreciate all the new people that have stopped by and come into chat. I'm having a really, like really good right time here, playing cool, uh, Outer Wilds. I'm so glad I rested for a week, gave myself some time to like, you know, kind of recover. Uh, and um, I'm so glad I, I was so, I was so, I, I was not ready to give up on this game after just trying it one time. I sometimes struggle with first person um, motion sickness in games. It kind of depends, but the headphones not like squeezing my head have definitely helped today. So that's, that's good. Um, but, uh, just remember that every single one of you matters. You are important. Don't ever forget how much you matter. Each one of you 
brings something unique to my community and something unique to the world that nobody else has. And I know I say that at the end of every single stream, but there is always, always, always somebody who needs it, who needs to hear it. Um, I just appreciate your support and I appreciate you guys being here. I appreciate my community so much. Um, sea of Thieves? I don't know anything about Sea, sea of Thieves. Check my mail? My, 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 like my mailbox? I have to go get Charlotte. I'll check my mail. Um, uh, uh, tomorrow will be, let's see, tomorrow's Thursday. There's a possibility, oh, you're a pirate. Sounds very exciting. There's a possibility tomorrow will actually be a stream where I make Charlotte's like Zelda, like link sleeve. I'm not sure. Um, I will keep the discord posted on that. I don't, I don't really know. Cause I have a lot of party stuff I have to get ready for. So I can either stream that or we can, or we can play games. Technically it should be a nobody saves the world. Um, either way, I do have a discord. Um, so, uh, if you'd like to join that, feel free. It's a good, wholesome, positive place. That's my goal is spreading positivity through streaming, through my discord. Um, I can be an overwhelmingly positive person. <laughs> it's not for everyone, but anyway. Um, and, uh, just remember that you never know, um, what somebody's going through. So choose kindness. Um, I appreciate everybody's support and everybody coming and hanging out with me. You could be anywhere and you're here. And I love that. Um, <laughs> Ruby got a positivity vaccine. So, uh, but I'm having so much fun playing outer wilds. It, it's like something crazy literally happens like every couple minutes. I it's, it is just, it is so wild to me. What an interesting game. <laughs> Ruby's like, nice try. I don't know. I don't know anything about Sea of Thieves, but I do love the idea of being a pirate. That sounds like a lot of fun. Uh, yeah, no more motion sickness. Awesome. Awesome. So I'll be back tomorrow. Uh, same time. This 1 p.m. thing seems to be working. I need to change all the times on like my Twitch page and all that stuff. But um, uh, I'll be back tomorrow and we'll kind of see what happens because I do need to make Charlotte's sleeve. But maybe I can do that tonight. I don't really know. So we'll just kind of have to see how that goes. But, um, I will see all of you guys tomorrow. E yeah. Uh, no, I don't think I crashed a whole lot today. I don't think so. I don't know. I can't remember, but I'll see you guys tomorrow. And no, I think that was the only one, but I like was crushed by that big sand thingy. So Anyway, you guys are all amazing people. I love you all. And uh, thanks for being here. Oh, no. I appreciate it. Oh, yeah. And uh, I will see oh, everybody what? tomorrow. Adios, everybody. Less than time zone. Have a good time zone. I love you all. And I'll see you tomorrow. Okay, bye. Dog, pig, dog, pig, dog, pig, loaf of bread. <laughs> See you later.